Hi, and welcome to another episode of Quarantine Hair Salon. I am Michelle, and I need to dye my hair. If you watched my vlogs, um, lockdown day three was the last time that I dyed my hair. If we do a little cross section here, yeah, you can see. Yeah, it kind of needs another color. Um, there's this one specific Japanese account. I will link it in uh, the description below. I really enjoy this man's work. And seeing as we're in a time where I'm not exactly going to be able to jump in a plane and fly all the way to Japan because, uh, first of all, pandemic. Second of all, I'm broke. I am going to have to do this by myself. Um, so what happened was, this was actually one of the inspirations that i liked and also this is what i think is gonna happen today what i got was for permanent color i bought the what's this one called mocha brown it's number four so this is gonna be the main part of the color and then for the how would you say it under color i bought another new it's um purple fantasy i I'm in love with this product. I've previously colored my hair with the pink. I've colored it this purple before mixed with blue. Um, I had a Kylie Jenner type situation with roots that came out. And I had the uh, ocean burst at the bottom. So I'm very familiar with this product. And also if I'm not mistaken this is also made in South Africa. does it say manufactured yep south african pine town so good old south african brand um just a disclaimer i am not a hairstylist i'm not a hair person i actually have been cutting and dyeing my own hair the last three years that i've been cutting and dyeing my own hair so i think we are gonna invasion it in the bathroom um i wanted to dye all my hair brown and then color it then um, bleach it but i'm afraid that the bleach will get on the colored hair and then it's a thing where if i bleach it all out now and some of the color touches it it's not a big deal um i'm also not going to use all the bleach because i don't plan on putting it over my whole head i'm actually going to measure out and maybe use half of the bleach because it's just going to be literally just over a quarter of my head that's gonna have bleach on it it's gonna be mainly on the roots and then i'll pull it through um like for five minutes i'll pull it through the bottom here because this this technically down here is already fully bleached it's just got color laid over it that's why it's uh that's so damaged at the bottom is because it needs it actually needs a cut but i want to I want to dye it first and then we'll cut it afterwards so this side's gonna get purple and that's it let's let's do some application um, if you're wondering always wear an old shirt please don't mess up new shirts i have also got a ugly black shirt you'll see most of these dye videos on instagram they usually have a horrendous top on because you can't color or bleach your hair with just normal clothes get something that's already fucked up i hope this is gonna work now we're gonna section the hair i have just had normal little clips okay let's do middle okay so i just want this small section here so let's go like this the problem is with things like this is um, there's a clear tutorial because that's his way of doing it and I'm basically <sighs> just trying to think about how he would do it but I think this is enough here eh? like this because it's I suppose I know it should be off here yeah. and then through like that this is where it becomes very questionable from my side. 
But I guess this is a quarantine salon for you. <laughs> quarantine salon, the place where you can't see behind your head. Okay. I think... Now I'm wondering, should I keep more? This looks like not as much hair. Okay, let's... I think that's the beauty of it, is I can judge as I'm going now. Let's take another slice. Okay. I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna look at my watch. I don't want this side of my hair falling out. Having one of those things where you pull it and just the hair casually starts coming out. So I'm gonna stop talking and I'm gonna focus on just dyeing my hair. So. Another thing that's important other than gloves is if you do decide to bleach your hair yourself, which is a major possibility seeing as we are doing weird things to ourselves. Um, is to always keep an eye on your watch the thing is it's not from when all the hair is finished it's from when the first hair is finished if you understand what i'm saying so it's 20 minutes from when it laid here and not here so that's why fast application is the key so i'm gonna do that and you watch about five minutes as you can see probably right there it's lifting quite well so i'm just gonna climb into the last bit of bleach here in the ends this part right now is mainly focused on how brave you are um how far you're willing to go because um i know i'm gonna get banding because it's in the nature of bleaching your um roots yourself at home and <laughs> I know it's gonna be look like a mess I think this is as far as I'm going to go I think I'm gonna wash it out so rinse the hair and here's a small cross section of my hot roots I don't know I don't know if this is worth it bleaching the hair like this we'll see tomorrow when I add the color welcome to another high quality day at Michelle's Ratchet Salon. Um, well, as you can see, here we've got the hot root situation. And at first I thought, no, you can't really see a difference until I check the other side and you can see there is quite a difference in what the coloring I did. Um, today, what the plan is, is we are going to start with um, the semi-permanent purple and then we're going to go in with the rest of the hair with the brown okay i might be bouncing between here and the mirror there um just to make sure that i section off correctly if you can see you can definitely see this was bleached compared to actually my whole head is horrible. Why am I just keep, why am I joking myself? Why am I doing this to myself? As you can see, most of the hair coming out is the lighter bleached hair. It'd be like that, guys. If you bleach your hair and you're gonna get lost. It's the way of that's the nature of bleach. I'm quickly going to section my hair out. Semi-permanent color first because that can stay on for um, no particular time and no particular time frame usually this one recommends 45 minutes I feel like a lot of times with semi-permanent hair color because it's not a seriously damaging thing to do with your hair that you can leave it on for as long as what you are willing to to gamble for I mean I've never done any serious damage with semi permanent hair color it's the bleach that gets you Wow, I like the way 
this looks. I don't know if it picks up on camera. But it's got the dark purple, then the pink, and then the light edges. actually going to record I can't see myself on the viewfinder but as you can see I actually decided to mix in the second um, batch because that amount started to look very 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 what am I saying it's not enough very what what's that things up hmm why am I so why was I so messy this time I promise you other times I dye my hair it's not like this look at me look at me looks like I took a shit down my neck <laughs> what the freaking what a why did I do that it reminds me of that freaking um this whole place reminds me of that part of uh, Dumb and Dumber. Oh my god. And I'm leaving! There's shit everywhere. There's shit everywhere! Damn it! There's shit on the windows! Oh my god! My house is full of shit! He's shit everywhere! Look what he did! He's shit all over the wall! Here we are. It's been a few hours and now I think it's it's time for a reveal. And this, <laughs> this is not this is not really not really what I expected. I really thought this brown was lighter brown if i look at my hair in the mirror it looks fake it still has a lot of shine to it so hopefully um this would wash out a bit more and become lighter but i do like this purple bit i don't know how much if it looks like let's see if i open up here more light comes in if you can see if it does what it does on the internet is a big my head. 
Is it doing the thing? Should have taken more purple. I don't know. But I guess this is what you get if you go to Michelle's lockdown salon. I actually look like a first profile picture on Facebook, Michelle. I. <laughs> I guess this is as close as what I'm gonna get to a cool Japanese hair color. <sighs> I guess this is the flea market version of this hair color. I tried. <laughs> See you next time. Next time. It's a big video. It's a big video. I hope. I hope everybody. I hope you enjoyed watching me. Do whatever with my hair. Bye.